Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, make sure to smash that subscribe button and turn on those post notifications because YouTube will not show you my video if you don't turn on those notifications. So make sure to, you know, turn those on. I posted two house videos so far. Um, my last one was my moving in one. I will link it up there. Since then, I've gotten a lot more furniture, more decor, all that. So I just want to do a little bit of an update. But the main reason I'm making this video is tonight I'm having like a welcome party. So my family's going to come over and come see it. And I just thought it'd be fun to vlog. And you guys want updates. So here's updates. Now, before we actually get started, if you didn't know, I have merch. It's really cute. I have this like clothing rack I just bought to display all of my merch, my own personal merch shop. We've got hoodies, pullovers, shirts, hats, anything that you want. And you can buy all of it at cindymcgee.com. It'll also be down in the description. So I just finished getting ready. My hair is still drying, but other than that, I'm ready. It's actually finally a little bit cold enough. Let's see. It's 71. Earlier it was like 68, so I was like, oh, it's chilly. But I'm wearing like this sweater and plaid skirt. All of this stuff was in a giveaway bag because when I thought I was moving to New York City, I got rid of like all my clothes. But it turns out that it was just like hiding somewhere in my house. I never actually donated them. So now I get all my favorite clothes back from last fall and I love fall clothes. It's my favorite. But anyway, I'm just gonna walk through the house, show you guys what's new and let's go ahead and get started. So we're just gonna start in my like third room with like the cat slash getting ready room, whatever you wanna call it. This is kind of the only new thing. I just got this rack for all of my merch. That's all like old merch and stuff in that bucket. And then of course my vanity. I put my ring light in here and now I can't stand any other lighting because it's so bright. In my bathroom, I now have a curtain rod. My curtain doesn't come for another day, but it's like one of those rounded ones. So that's gonna be really nice. I also got these nice matching towels because I have this gray towel, but I didn't have gray actual towels, so now I do. My entryway is finally complete. Um, I got this bench. Pretty much everything I got is off Facebook Marketplace. This mirror is from Goodwill. This rack thing I had in my room before. And then this bench I got literally for $20 on Facebook Marketplace. Look how freaking cute this little walkway is. Um, I got these pillowcases on Amazon and this plant from Target, I wanna say. So I bought new curtains because these are actually blackout curtains and I needed two on each side because the window is so big. Then in my living room, I don't know if this was done, but I hung up that mirror. I got this like hexagon shelf thing. I got this plant from this random like plant store nearby. It's a fake plant, but isn't that so cute in that little basket? I just think that was like the cutest thing. Definitely needs a lot more decorating, but we are getting there. And now for my favorite part that finally, I feel like makes it feel like a home and not just some random place, is I got a kitchen table. And here it is, my kitchen table. It is so freaking cute and perfect. It's like farmhouse vibes, has a bench, and it's like real wood. Some guy literally made this, like handmade it where I live, and he was just selling it on Facebook Marketplace for like $200. This rug was literally $20. It kind of has tears in it, but I honestly like it. It fits the whole like boho messy vibe and I know he would literally tear it apart, so that's fine. These chairs, let me just tell you something. These are the most comfortable chairs I've ever sat in. I haven't even decided if I'm fully gonna keep them here as like my kitchen dining room chairs. Cause like I have a bench on the other side, so if I have guests, like literally six people could sit on that bench and then I just have these two chairs over here. Um, but I also might put one in my office for now. I'm literally just working in here because I really like the vibes in here. But yeah, I got these two chairs, $75 for both of them, and they are super high quality. They're really comfortable and they fit my like vibe of the house so well. I got them on Facebook Marketplace. Literally like, if you're shopping for anything, check Facebook Marketplace first because there's always these random things that people are getting rid of and they think it's junk, but it's like the best thing ever for you. And now for my kitchen. My kitchen is probably the thing I'm most obsessed with. I finally went grocery shopping for the first time today because I did not have a fridge. I still don't have a fridge. I'm actually using Dallin's May fridge. 
literally from Dallas Road. But eventually we're gonna get made fridge. We're just waiting for a good deal on Facebook Marketplace because I'm not trying to drop serious cash on the fridge. So I got this little, it's a chips and dip bowl at Goodwill. I was gonna make it into a like side table at my entryway, but I found that bench, so I'm good there. So I literally just have like all these fruits, lemons, avocados, apples, and oranges. I just love how it finally looks like someone lives here. It makes me so happy. Over here, I have all of my like jars. These just have flour, sugar, powdered sugar, and brown sugar. I don't even like cook that often, but I was like, oh yeah, most people have that in their house, so I need that. And it just looks really, really cute. I got this set on Amazon. I will try to link it down below if I remember. I love these because they like seal tight, which is great. And they come with little spoons. Like, who doesn't love little spoons? It's the freaking cutest thing ever. So if you are going for like farmhouse vibes, these are amazing and they come in like a bunch of colors. And then literally at Walmart for like $3, I got this salt and pepper set. And look how cute it is, it's so cute. They have little polka dots and they say pepper and salt. Now over here, I got this jar from Goodwill. It was literally like $2. It just says like miscellaneous on it. I make it my like coin and money jar. Bananas and Sandy, Dallin's mom, got me a little house for my gift of this little fake succulent. Thing. I can't kill it. And then over here, my parents actually gave me their toaster because I think they wanted a new one. So that was really nice. This is just part of a plant I ripped apart that was my parents that they gave to me and I like ripped it up and made it into like different things. But um, this is a stick and shake glass. I don't know if you can see that. But I, I, I literally accidentally stole this one time at an away football game like my sophomore year of high school. And it's just been a joke ever since, so I just keep it and I think it's funny. Um, this like little floral thing was in my room before. Finally got a paper towel holder today. I was just chilling with the paper towels just out. And this basket was from Goodwill for like a dollar. Oh, what's great is my parents gave me their old trash can because they wanted a new one. This is literally just an excuse for my parents to get all new stuff because they're like, oh, we'll help Sid and we'll just give it to her, which amazing, so grateful, but now they, and, you know, get all new stuff. Like they give me mixing bowls and pans and all that, which, oh my gosh, when you move into a place and it's just you and it's your first time living alone, it's so freaking expensive. Like you have to buy a trash can and trash bags and toilet paper and cleaning supplies and pans and spatulas and spoons and forks and plates and bowls, and it all adds up. What? All right, it's time to start getting ready for the party. So I, I bought Listen, I knew I was gonna be lazy, so I bought ingredients to make cookies, but I also just bought cookie dough. So I'm just gonna put this in the oven. Yeah. He thought he was in trouble. Aww. He, was still in the he got in a lot of trouble. Today. He was in trouble, but. He's been in trouble twice today. He's been a bad kid. He uh, knocked the plant over. He peed on my pants and knocked the plant over. Bad kid. You don't need to pick up the camera. This is my first time using the oven. Who, for those of you who don't know Han, this Hi. is Sydney's sister, I'm Han. Han. Han the goose. <laughs> Han the goose. <laughs> Han the goose. That is me. Oh, Eat off of this side. Yeah, so that's that, what I was yeah. Okay. okay, so there's 24. So yes. we need to do six rows of four. Math. Quick maths. Quick maths. There's actually not 24 because I ate one. Oh, there's actually <laughs> gonna only be 22 because I'm gonna eat one. I think I'm gonna eat another one. <gasps> Who's it gonna be for? Yeah, you're the goodest boy. I'm tired. Sid needs a Red Bull. We need to get her an emergency Red Bull. You need one in like a glass thing you that go, you break. Can you go get on that? D is that my job right yeah. now? Take I, the camera and go get Red Bull. We'll really? see when we get back. So I thought the pizza wasn't gonna get here till six, but it actually got here at 5.30, which like fair enough, cause I set the time at 5.30, but I thought they'd start delivering. I don't know, I was confused. <laughs> so I got some Sprite. We're setting up the fruit tray. Han's good at cutting apples. So she is currently cutting apples. All right, as I say in every cooking video, I'm terrified of ovens, but here I go. Should I put it in the middle or the top? Top. Okay. I don't cook in the oven. I'm scared of it, so I wouldn't know. Actually, yeah. maybe would the middle be better? Um, it's already in. I'm not okay. It now. Yeah. Um. So then we also are gonna have queso, salsa, and oh hey, my artichoke dip. This is so there. cute. And hummus. 
We are done with all the cooking now. Cookies are done, they actually taste bomb. Yeah, everything looks nice. Hannah and Lauren helped me clean up. Besides that, LOL. And we lit candles, so everything looks nice. Uh, How's nice. it going hey, in here? Put the curtain rod up, check it out. Thank you. Oh, yay, it's like the rounded one. That's so nice. All right, everyone is here, and my dad got FOMO, so he's sitting right in the middle of here <laughs> and here. Thought that was They're great. Trying to figure out which party is the cool party. I think yeah, this one is probably the cool region. party. Brittany, Brittany came. Ball. She isn't giving birth yet, so that's great. She pretty much is. <laughs> We're just yeah, waiting at this point. Oh, thanks, Brittany. I know. At least this way I'll just run. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Pay 12 came. Hello. And my sisters are still here, obviously. And then over here we have Dallin's parents and Amy and Dallin. I'm so scared JD's just gonna snap the chair. Look when he sits on it. Get, wait, get up and then sit down. Well, it's just sitting. If he breaks my chair, I'm gonna be so mad. All right, well that was successful. Everyone finally left. I'm exhausted. <sighs> Two hours of just showing people my house and talking about it. I'm tired. But yeah, it was really fun. All my family and Down's family came and they all kind of took turns coming in. There was food, it was great, and yeah. Can you like turn the sink off? Yeah, do you want me to film you? Thanks, no it's okay. I'm excited because I finally got to show everyone my house that I've been so excited about because it's all like Pinteresty and it's just Pinterest dreams coming true, you know how it is. I'm ready to just chill and do nothing. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to go buy my merch if you are interested, Um our Turn on post notifications. Yes. My social media will be down below and we'll see you in the next one. Bye! Bye.